Hello royal folks. It's good to see you all here again. This is your regular dose of royal news and analysis. But before we start, please subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon. Thanks. There are so many royal residences that it can sometimes be hard to keep up. In the latest news, beginning in the fall, the Cambridges will live at Adelaide Cottage in Windsor, while the Queen will remain at Windsor Castle, and Prince Charles and Camilla will remain at Clarence House in London. But what will happen when Prince Charles, followed by Prince William, takes the throne? Will the two men move their respective official households to Buckingham Palace, where the Queen was based for decades? Former royal footman Stephen Kay weighs in. It's about modernization, isn't it? Kay tells Slingoopins in New Tab. Will William want to live at Buckingham Palace? Is that something that may continue? Or will the palace become more of a museum? My view is that because people view Buckingham Palace as the head office, it's important to keep those traditions alive. The moment they start to be out of the palace and living somewhere else, that kind of erodes some of the traditions we have in this country, and I think William is very aware of that. For Kay, it's about maintaining some of the mystique that makes royalty so enticing, all while making sure to move with the times. The Queen has always said, I need to be seen to be believed, and Charles and William know how important that is, Kay continues. I think William and Kate will do a fabulous job when they take over the monarchy. Like many other commentators, Kay then expresses regret for the way things have panned out between Prince William and Prince Harry. I'm just quite sad that he doesn't have the support of his brother anymore, he says. I think we were all hoping they were going to be the Fab Four and the future of the monarchy. But sadly, that's not to be. Well, there's still time for a reconciliation. At the moment, it looks like the plan is for the Cambridges to remain at Adelaide while George, Charlotte and Louise are school-aged, then potentially return to Kensington Palace. So what do you think, guys? Please share your thoughts in the comments. Until then, thanks for watching. We'll see you again with some more interesting news about royal family. Thank you.